Five Hot Stocks Weekly Watchlist. Stocks Power Plays to Profits, Swing Trades. Legal Disclosure. We are not financial advisors. The information contained in this video is for entertainment purposes only. Before investing, please consult a licensed professional. Any stock purchases we make should not be considered investment recommendations. We are not liable for any losses you may incur for investing and trading in the stock market in an attempt to mirror what we do. Unless investments are FDIC insured, they may decline in value and or disappear entirely. Please be careful and never invest more than you are willing to lose. 5 Hot Stocks to Watch for the Week of June 13, 2021 AMC Catalyst for this stock is mainly based on hedge funds having to cover June 18, 2021. AMC Entertainment Holdings, Inc., through its subsidiaries, involved in the theatrical exhibition business. The company owns, operates, or has interests in theaters. As of March 12, 2021, it operated approximately 1,000 theaters and 10,700 screens in the United States and internationally. The company was founded in 1920 and is headquartered in Leewood, Kansas. Archon. Catalyst for this stock is mainly based on NASDAQ article. China is at the point in its development now that it isn't as interested in buying services and technologies from the West, but building its own services and industry for its needs. It is focused on servicing its own economy rather than depending on outside companies to do it. And that's where Archon comes in. It's the first non-state-owned Chinese oil field services company focused on the Chinese energy patch. By having its own oil field services, it takes the risk out of the U.S. government cutting off trade with China and affecting its economy. A critical sector to secure as energy. With a market cap of $250 million, after a 736% run year to date, this microcap stock isn't in the same league as U.S. global powerhouses in this sector. But it's a start. It's also involved in unconventional drilling like fracking. Recon Technology, Limited, provides hardware, software, and on-site services to companies in the petroleum mining and extraction industry in the People's Republic of China. The company offers equipment, tools, and other hardware related to oilfield production and management, and transportation, and develops and sells industrial automation control and information solutions. It also provides equipment for oil and gas production and transportation, including heating furnaces and burner, as well as enhancing techniques comprising packers of fracturing, production packers, sand prevention in oil and water wells, water locating and plugging techniques, fissure shaper, fracture acidizing technique, and electronic broken down service to resolve block up and freezing problems. In addition, the company offers automation systems and services, including pumping unit controller that monitors the pumping units and collects data, RTU to monitor natural gas wells and collect gas well pressure data, wireless dynamometers and wireless pressure gauges, electric multi-way valves for oilfield metering station flow control, and natural gas flow computer systems. Further, it provides Recon SCADA oilfield monitor and data acquisition system for supervision and data collection, EPC service of pipeline SCADA system for pipeline monitoring and data acquisition, EPC service of oil and gas wells SCADA system for monitoring and data acquisition of oil wells and natural gas wells, EPC service of oilfield video surveillance and control system to control the oil and gas wellhead and measurement station areas and technique service for digital oilfield transformation. Additionally, the company offers oilfield wastewater treatment solutions and related chemicals, and oily sludge disposal solutions. Recon Technology, Limited, was incorporated in 2007 and is headquartered in Beijing, the People's Republic of China. FAMI Catalyst for this stock is mainly based on the expected company update this week along with 0.75 gap fill potential in the short term. Farmy, Inc., together with its subsidiaries, processes and sells agricultural products in China, the United States, Japan, Canada, Europe, Korea, and the Middle East. The company offers shiitake and mu er mushrooms, and other edible fungi products, including bamboo fungi, 
Agrisibi agarilla, Pleurotus oringi, Griffola frondosa, Caprinus comatus, and Hericium arenaceus. It also operates Farmy Gisai, an online store that sells edible fungi products under Foracin and Farmy Leongpin brands. The company offers its products to restaurants, cafeterias, and local specialty stores, as well as through distributors. Farmy, Inc. was founded in 2015 and is headquartered in Lishui, China. GLBS. Catalyst for this stock is mainly based on the following factors like gap fills to execute all the way up to $225, plus low float and some good short interest. Potential short squeeze when ER comes out with solid numbers. E. R could be as soon as June 17, 2021. Globus Maritime Limited, an integrated dry bulk shipping company, provides marine transportation services worldwide. It owns, operates, and manages a fleet of dry bulk vessels that transport iron ore, coal, grain, steel products, cement, alumina, and other dry bulk cargoes. As of December 31, 2020, the company owned and operated six vessels with a total carrying capacity of 381,738 deadweight tonnage. It charters its vessels to operators, trading houses, shipping companies and producers, and government-owned entities. The company was incorporated in 2006 and is based in Athens, Greece. Globus Maritime Limited operates as a subsidiary of Ferment Trading Limited. CMMB Catalyst for this stock is mainly based on low float with volume and a high short interest. Chemomab Therapeutics Limited engages in the research and development of biological drugs for the treatment of inflammatory and fibrotic diseases. The company was formerly known as Ankiano Therapeutics Limited and changed its name to Chemomab Therapeutics Limited on March 16, 2021. Chemomab Therapeutics Limited was incorporated in 2011 and is based in Tel Aviv, Israel. TradeMoneyATM.com S bonus stock for the week of June 14, 2021. VXRT. Catalyst for this stock is mainly based on the following list of events. Pill New PT of $18 by Piper Sandlers. Pill Board and Investor Conference this and next week. Pill Full Phase 1 data for pill form of COVID vaccine. Pill funding for COVID vaccine is straight up imminent AF. Pill Oral COVID Vaccine Moving to Phase 2 Pill Johnson & Johnson Licensing Deal for the Oral Flu Vaccine Due Any Day Now Pill Oral Vaccine for Norovirus Phase 1B Has Started Pill Market Cap Less Than $1 BB Novavax Had Over $10 BB Market Cap After Their Phase 1 Trial Using Boomer Needles Pill No Debt To Speak Of Pill People Rather Pills To Needles Vaxart, Inc., a clinical stage biotechnology company, engages in the discovery and development of oral recombinant protein vaccines based on its proprietary oral vaccine platform. The company's product pipeline includes norovirus vaccine, an oral tablet vaccine, which is in a phase IB clinical trial with bivalent oral tablet vaccine for the GI.1 and GII.4 norovirus strains, seasonal influenza vaccine, which is in phase 2 clinical trial for the treatment of H1 influenza infection, respiratory syncytial virus vaccine, and coronavirus vaccine, which completed phase 1 clinical trial for the treatment of SARS-CoV-2 infection. It is also developing therapeutic vaccines for cervical cancer and dysplasia caused by human papillomavirus. Vaxart, Inc. has a research collaboration agreement with Janssen Vaccines and Prevention BV. Janssen to evaluate the company's proprietary oral vaccine platform for the Janssen Universal Influenza Vaccine Program. The company is headquartered in South San Francisco, California. Hope you enjoy our five hot stocks for the week combined with successful strategies along with proper money management. We love seeing the results our TradeMoneyATM.com members get and invite you to share and enjoy the value.